Hi, I am so sorry. I know after day six, I've been away and I took some videos, but I had no time to upload it or edit it because I was staying at my sister's and she got two kids, niece and nephew, and I love them. I just love hanging out with them and I just didn't want to spend too much time on editing. I'm sorry, but I'll just catch up. So then I, well, I took some videos while we were hanging out and eating and eating, <laughs> but I did not have a chance to uh, document or uh, keep record of all the experiences. So, well, my food portion is coming later, but just want to say, so my niece is very much into ballet dancing because, well, you know that I love dancing too. I, I used to do ballet as well. Now I'm more like hip hop and I do hula. So dancing and my uh, nephew is into uh, karate and also uh, soccer as well. But karate, I used to do kenpo, shorinish kenpo, so I got black belts. So I know the martial arts. So whenever I, I went to see their classes and I was like, oh my god. Like someday in future, I want to dance with her, or I want to fight with him. Like fight as in like match, you know, not the real fight. So I was just, you know, so inspired, and also just the passion that they have for these things. Like they don't think about like making, you know, they don't do it to show off to people. They just love love it, and they want to be better at it. And of course, yeah, they think about oh, maybe I want to be a professional about that, but. Because they love it, it's not that, you know, for example, like when my niece is into one move, it's not that, oh, if I don't do this, I don't get a job. She, she's concerned because she just wants to do it, you know, otherwise she feels like, I don't know, it's, it's, it's different for me, of course, uh, that's how I started acting and being show business. But the, the passion is, it gets kind of sometimes clouded with the reality because you make it as a business and it's more than about being passionate about it. But it just, hanging out with niece and my niece and nephew, it just reminded me that I still have that passion. And it was just beautiful looking at it. And Okay, I, I wanna, I wanna keep that, keep keep that alive, and no shame of pursuing it, even though it doesn't make money. Sometimes it's, it can be very frustrating, but I'm I'm glad I, I, I feel I'm lucky that I still understand that. So just wanna say that. Okay, so now here's the fun part. So I went out with my sister, my niece, and also they had a takoyaki party for me here last night. So coming up next. My sister lives in an area called Shinsaibashi. It's one of the major cities in Osaka. It's well known for this uh, big shopping, uh, what do you call it, arcade, I guess? <laughs> and a lot of good food. And this is not just Osaka, like in Japan overall, people don't mind waiting in line for good things. It's actually, it's more fun. That means like you're doing something cool, right? So here they have a famous cheesecake. Uh, on the left, it said uh, red part, it says very hot. <laughs> but the Japanese actually says uh, like fresh out of oven, like freshly made. And the uh, right part is uh, it was baked two hours ago. <laughs>
so I have lunch with my sister and I love hot pot nabe and also like mochi which is <laughs> We moved to an area called Umeda. It's a little bit more modern, I would say. And this restaurant features motsu hot pot. Uh, there's like intestine underneath. I hope I'm not grossing you out. I love those. They have more flavor. So it's kind of miso flavor soup. It comes with this whole set. Uh, it's so yummy. I love hot pot, especially in the winter time. Mm. Yum, yum. So we finished the shopping of the day and we're going home because my sister and her family, her husband, uh, kids are having takoyaki party for me and I just want to make a video how to make takoyaki at home. エンジョイ。ね、字幕を作るの今回は。そして、えっと、これは、たこ焼きの、なんていうのはね、生地。生地か。生地を、これ、この、この。たこ焼きの生地っていうのね。うん。これは、生地を掘り込んで、使ってる
。ちなみにハリー君が一番好きなたこ焼きはどんなんですか？何が入ってるのが好き？え？ソーセージかな。ソーセージ。ノ、う、イ、ん、ちゃんはどれが好き？たこ焼き＆チーズ。たこ焼き＆チーズらしいです。私は。てか、他のものはあんま食べたことがないんだよね。じゃあ、今日は初挑戦で食べてみます。では、では。